Welcome to the testing world. In this session, we are going to cover few more commands which are related to the application or network. So first two commands are related to the application. So first command is where is we can find out the location of any application and the other command is which which shows which application will be run by default. So I am coming to my Linux environment, clear the screen and here where is Java. So it should display the location where my Java exists in my system. The next command is which Java. So which Java is going to execute by default. So that is the location of the Java which is going to be executed by default. So these are the two commands which are related to find out any application, location of the application or, or which version of the application is going to execute by default. Clear the screen. The next command which I'm going to use is related to the network. I want to ping any system or a website. So ping which is quite similar to Windows on the Windows when you want to ping some system or website. So we are using same command. So ping www.yahoo.com. So here it is pinging a particular URL. Control Z is to stop it. So here we have seen the ping with the help of the ping command. We can ping a particular website or the system. The next command is who is who is getting that domain. So I want to get who is holding the domain www.yahoo.com. So it will bring all the information which is related to the particular domain. So here we see who is server version is 2.0 domain name is .com. So complete information about the domain displayed over here. Next command is we want to get the DNS information about the domain. So command is dig www.yahoo.com and here it display DNS information about the domain. Next two commands are related to the downloading some file or some content from the internet. So I want to download this yahoo.com content so i'm writing wget is the command www.yahoo.com start downloading and in between i stop it so it was downloading the content and i have stopped it the next command is wget hyphen c and then yahoo.com so hyphen c is used to continue last download so i was downloading this yahoo.com and let's take an example like total 10 mb data is going to be download 5 has been downloaded already and then i stopped it so if i use wget hyphen c hyphen c means start the previous download means 5 mb was downloaded it will download rest 5 MB. I'm running it so it will start from where it was stopped before. So these are the commands we have covered in the session. First two are related to find out the application location and which application is going to execute by default, and the rest five are related to my network command, like I can find out the domain information, we can find out DNS information, we can download some file as well. Thanks for watching this video.